Good music, good wine, and good friends. You're listening to Dave Matthews and the Dreaming Tree Patio Blend, a playlist featuring some of Dave's favorite artists. So grab a glass of red, white, or rosé and find a comfy chair. Pour a great story with the Dreaming Tree. Tap now to learn more. Please enjoy our wines responsibly. 2019 The Dreaming Tree, Geyserville, California. Capital One knows life doesn't alert you about your credit card. Pitch hitting, catcher number two. Also Karen in row J eating the hot dog. Did you mean to tip 167% yesterday at Lake Cafe restaurant? Just checking. So meet Eno, the Capital One assistant that catches things that might look wrong, like over tipping, then sends an alert to your phone and helps you fix it. Eno, another way Capital One is watching out for your money when you're not. Capital One, what's in your wallet? See CapitalOne.com for details. Limitations apply. All right, welcome, welcome, welcome to On the Screws Golf, uh, the Cliff Top Links Tournament. This is our pro account that we're going to play this evening on Wednesday, which is the last evening to qualify. So let's go. All right, welcome to all. Hello, hello, hello. Let's adjust the volume so no one gets their ears blown off. I think that's good right there. Hey, fuck Tomefo. <laughs> to mofo. <laughs> All right, those are some awesome names. Thanks for subscribing. I love it. Much appreciated. I'm just going to smile about that. Let's do it. Oh, let's take a look here. Let's see who's in the stream. Let's go. 
All right, Snoop Rob was in the house first. Welcome, sir. Thank you, my friend. Good to see you. Shane Downing is also here. What's up, my brother? And good luck. Thank you for the good luck, my friend. Matt Fisher, thank you for the good luck. Always awesome to see you, my friend. And of course, the stable. Mr. Troy Scott is here. Let's go. That's right, man. Let's get this done tonight. Mama Bulls is in the house. Welcome, my dear. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And thank you for the good luck. Much appreciated. Jason Harvey's here. Yes, sir. Hello, hello. Thank you for the good luck and thank you for the support, my friend. Always appreciated when you are in the stream, my friend. Just trying to get this uh, back up. Okay, good. It went to sleep on me. All right. Um, Emily, yes, 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 yes. Hello, my sweetheart. Nice to see you. So nice to see you. Thanks for being here. J40, thank you so much about the uh, the intro. I appreciate that. Um, we worked hard on that. And uh, thank you very much for the, uh, the kudos on the end results. Much appreciated, my friend. Show offs in the house. Thank you for the good luck, my friend. Thank you. Aaron Meadows, you know it. Hey, all. What's up, Aaron? Good to see you, my friend. Thank you for being in the stream. Jim North is here. Thank you for the good luck, my friend. And then... Uh, Tomofo is here. Thank you for the subscription, my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And did you see my Tour 7 Unlock chest yet? It was pretty good. I did not, Aaron. I'm sorry, my friend. I've been uh, I've been out of town. I was, um, first of all, I was down last week over the 4th of July with my father who was in the hospital down in Birmingham. Thank goodness. Thank you all for your concerns and your prayers for those of you who reached out. Um, he is back into a skilled facility, which is great. Ron the mend in recovery to get back into his independent facility. So awesome news there. Got back then late on the weekend. And then uh, Monday, um, we, uh, we took off for New Jersey. We had seven hours of interviews on Tuesday, yesterday in New Jersey for my company, trying to get a national director's position in, um, I guess that's a promotion for me. And uh, we'll have to wait and see for another week or so before we hear who's gonna get that role. So did that, got back late, late last night, streamed a couple pro, uh, rookies just to get them through. Now we're gonna do our last account of the, uh, of the qualifiers and that's our pro and uh let's go get it done right bam all right here we go keith yes sir good to see you brother good to see you all right so i have a little bit of notes here fun and james what's up my friend thank you for being in the stream my friend good to see you as always and um Looks like uh, we got a packed house of 20. I love it. Thank you so much for being here. And uh, like I said, let's talk about what we're going to do on hole one, and then we'll get right to it. What's up, Mossy? Good to see you, brother. Yes. Hi, Ashley. So nice to see you in the chat, as always. Thank you for the good luck. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. All right. New subscriber, we did that already. Thank you, sir, once again. All right, let's go take a look at the bag real quick. We're gonna use the APOC three. We're gonna have a turkey ball. We're gonna use the thorn on our second shot after we successfully, oh, excuse me, successfully <laughs> um, navigate hole number one's tee shot. So what I have on the tee shot is, I have it in my wind app right now, which I'll remove the schematic in a minute. Plus 20% on the tee shot. It's a power two ball. We're gonna go full top, full right. We're gonna go full curl. And we're looking for about 400, 404 yards if we can get it down there into the fairway. If we do that, we should be at thorn min distance. And then we'll make our adjustments from there and see if we can't get uh, the eagle right out of the gate. So here we go. Let's, uh, let's hide that schematic. We will then hit entry into the pro category, and here we go. This is my first attempt at pro with this account, um, so let's see if we can't get it done. I think everything else is uh, set up. Ditto, yes sir, what is up Mike? Good to see you brother, great stream my friend. Thank you for your support my friend. And uh, let me get through this real quick and uh, we'll, uh, we'll do some intros I guess, right?
So full top, not too much right there. Oh boy, great ball right. Come on, baby, stay out of that rough on the fly. Oh, get out of there, get out. Ah. Too much curl. I did that uh, last time, and this is exactly what, uh, what I didn't want to do, which was too much APOC curl. And that, my friends, as you can see, was just a touch too much, so. That's all right. I mean, it's. I mean, it's not all right. We're uh, we're gonna be fine there. We're gonna put in a minus twenty percent adjustment on that second shot, and see if we can't uh, recover um, and make a very solid second shot recovery. That's a beautiful tee shot right there always like to give somebody a well played when they do an amazing shot that's what the number we were looking for right there about 404 407 so all right so let's just go three back do that stick it right there three two i'm assuming we'll just do mid adjustment here Actually, we'll go between min and mid, so that's about 0.6. Come on, let's go! Let's go! Let's go. Let's get that eagle right out of the gate, even off a misfire off the tee shot. Thank you, Scott. Appreciate you being in the stream, brother. Let's go. Bam. Thank you, Jason. Emily, thank you. <laughs> I was a little nervous there, but uh, we were able to uh, we were able to make that. And I'm going to give a little shout out to um, Aaron Meadows. Thank you, sir for the donation my friend you are such a gentleman thank you go in go in go in for him oh that's super close um i want to say that you know i used to be a paper guy right no no apps no adjustments just you know go off what uh, the game makers had two and a half years ago and i stuck to that stuck to that stuck to that i was winning banners and all of that and i'm like i'm never changing then obviously i saw other people absolutely killing it on the course with these apps so we did a few changes and over a lot of friendlies with my friends and i'm going to name one person here in particular jason harvey he absolutely convinced me that you know you don't have to stick to an actual min number mid number or max number 100 percent of the time so if it's between mid and min, right? Slide it up and down and add, a, add or subtract on that adjustment. So right there on that last shot, that's exactly what I did. It was between 0.9 and 0.4. It was a little short. So I said, yeah, let's go in between. Let's go 0.6. And uh, that eagle, all because of you, Jason Harvey. So thank you, sir, for that. Assist on hole number one of our pro account. So thank you, sir. I thought that shout out needed to occur. All right, let's take a look at hole number two. Oh, you want a replay? Okay, no. Nope. Let's do the replay real quick. And while he's doing that, I will set up Thank you, Ditto. Thank you, Michael Moss. Thanks, Jason. Thank you, Mama Bulls. I appreciate that.
And what do we always say, right? The only way you banner is if you hit perfect shots from these type of positions and have them go in. Bam, just on the left-hand edge. So uh, very lucky for that to go in. So, all right, bam. All right, hole number two. This is the one that I am uh, a little bit um, nervous about, everybody. So uh, we'll do our best. We're going to go quarterback 10. We're going to go full back, full right. We're going to say that that blue ring is going to cut the left rough. We're going to go to one-to-one -one adjustment. We're going to use a kingmaker, and we're going to see if we can't just get it on the green and make a putt. That's what we're trying to do here. Power three. I don't think I make any type of, since we're doing a one-to-one -one adjustment, I don't think I put any elevation on this, so let's go. These are slow smoke chipotle chicken egg and avocado go-getters. They're maple bacon, eggy smoked Gouda bundles of portable bliss. And they all pair perfectly with our new cold brew. Hey, Chad, good to see you, brother. Donnie Smith is here. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for the booms. Thank you, Ashley. Much appreciated. Food as it should be. All right. All right, my opponent's up. Okay, good. Let's get the uh, wind app. The arrow already adjusted. Take a free 30 day trial of premium and it might even make your month. 30 days of unlimited, uninterrupted music. No data bills, no skip restrictions, no ad interruptions. We Go can on, hide the schematic now. Tap the banner now to learn more. What we're going to do is try to take it um, a little bit down to the left there, beyond the, uh, the trap if we can. Oh, do I have the wrong. No, I have the right ball on, I think. Kingmaker? All right. A little long there for my opponent. Let's try to not do that if we can help ourselves. All right. Pull back. As full right as possible. Close enough. Like that. And then we're going to go one to one. So that's just five lovely rings. Oh, I hate when that happens. Are you kidding me? That's gone. Darn it. Give me a putt. All right, that's not too bad. Ah, you know, obviously um, I had a kingmaker on there. That is not the right ball. I need a power one ball or power two ball there because I can then use the adjustment. But with a power three ball, I'm just not going to be able to make that proper adjustment. And you can see, because I wasn't able to make the adjustment, I am not near the stick. So it's going to be a semi-long putt up the hill. And he makes it with a great shot. Okay, very good. Very good. Now, we just need to make a perfect shot here. Oh, that's a long-ass putt up that hill. Shoot. Well, we hit it perfect, and we had the right speed, and we made it. Yeah, I need to work on my uh, lag for my stream. It's a little bit, a um, little bit delayed, obviously. So,
Alright. Hey, Mr. Appleby! <laughs> I love you, man. What does on the screws golf mean? That is fantastic. Oh, I love it. That's awesome. Well, if you give me a minute, I'll tell you what on the screws golf means. If you really want to know, look at that garbage. Let's see what here. See what happens here. A little backspin. And a little bit too far to the left. All right. All right, on the screws golf, what does that mean? All right, let's say that really quick one more time for the millionth time on our stream. Okay, way back in the 1990s, in the 1980s, there was wood clubs, actual wooden clubs made of wood, the driver, the three wood, the two wood, the five wood, the seven wood, and they were all made of wood. And in the face of the club, they had four different screws that screwed in the face plate so as the face plate got worn down from you know hitting the ball over and over and over and over again it would crack etc you were able to unscrew those screws take out the face plate put a new face plate in and screw them back in and when someone usually hit a really great shot on that club face square and the ball went really far they would normally say man did i hit that on the screws so that's where on the screws come from if you have never heard that story before. So there we go. All right. Good start so far, folks. Good start so far. Oh, no. <laughs> One, well, which is it? Is it a rookie? Is it a pro? Is it an expert? Man, it's not a bad thing that you only have one account. I mean, maybe you can get two or three more in and get a total of four. And that's probably plenty. I'm only going to do four accounts. This I think four accounts, at most five this weekend myself. So, uh, absolutely. All right. Thor's Hammer 5 we're going to do. We're going to add 20% to our adjustment let's go ahead and pull up the schematic which is the par 5 we're going to take it down on the right hand side which is the white and black line you can see there we're going to try to go full top full left we are going to use a kingmaker here so that's already in we are then going to put in a guardian 7 for the back spin we should have enough distance to get there um We're looking for about a 367 yard drive if we can get it down there, okay? So with that being said, uh, we'll do max adjustment off of this tee shot and uh, let's get it done, ready? Denny, yes sir, good to see you. Wally's in the house as well. Thank you, Wally, for being here. Sandy Bell, yes! How are you, love? Nice to see you, so happy that you're here and much appreciated, that is amazing. That's awesome. I love all of you for being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, let's uh, let's go ahead. No, Jason, we're going to go Thor's Hammer 5. All right, 20%. Kingmaker. We're playing for birdie here, folks. We are not going for albatross. I mean, we're playing for eagle here. Excuse me. Not birdie. We're playing for eagle. We are not trying for some crazy albatross. That is pretty unrealistic. What we're going to do is uh, just play for the safe eagle. Hit it down there. Hit it on. Make a little putt. And uh, get our minus two. And we're going to move forward. KD! Yes, sir!
guys are awesome. Thanks for being here, KD. Much appreciated, pal. Much appreciated. Grab myself some water. Mr. J. Kading is the opponent. All right, here we go. Five point five off that is four point seven. All right, there it is. 368 yards, right at the number we were looking for. We said 367, we got 368. All right, I like it. All right, so now what we're gonna do is for our second shot, now that that first one has been accomplished, we're gonna go plus 10% and Guardian. Thank you, Jason. Thanks, brother, appreciate that. Mr. Michael Fox, that's right, sir. Good to see you, bro. Thanks for being here. We're having a, 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 a pretty good round so far. Um, made the eagle on one. Um, not a bad save on two from a long putt. And uh, going for our second shot to the green here um, for the potential eagle on hole number three here. Come on, stay out of the rough. Ah, God dang it. Hate that. Oh, how did that go that short? Oh, I didn't even overpower it, did I? I just, I just kind of uh, gave up on that. Well, that's all right. That's an e. I think that's fairway, so that should be a pretty straightforward up the hill chip for uh, with a firefly. Oh man, I'm gonna have to write that note down. You need to overpower that second shot. Need OP on this shot. Ah, first mistake. Darn it. I've been playing pretty good with uh, all my adjustments, putting the right numbers in, etc. And uh, unfortunately made our first mistake of the night. Please be in the fairway. I think that's fairway, so okay. All right, there it is. The old Firefly perfect shot comes through again. Love it. All right, right on track, everybody. Right on track. Um, actually, I played that with a plus 10%, which is a really actually probably you know, it's supposed to be a downhill shot, but uh, it, if you look at that from this spot here, it's probably a little bit 
maybe uphill, but from back where I was in that first um, fairway, um, you're probably right. It's probably an uphill shot, so it should have been minus 10. But you know what? Um, it, the only reason it wasn't there was because I didn't overpower it, give it enough kick to hit that fairway, get up on the green, and have an easy putt. So a little bit of note-taking right there, which is uh, put OP on, uh, on that second shot, and we'll be fine. So, all right, here we go. Um, looks pretty good so far. Let's take a look at the card, if you don't mind. We are 2-1-2 in pro, which is uh, right where we want to be. Right where we want to be. We got that. Uh, but if you play it, minus 10, no overpower needed. Okay. Um, ditto. You're probably probably right. Um, I'm going to make that adjustment, okay? Um, thank you for the, uh, the info, okay? Good info. I'll make that note. Minus 10... needs no OP. Okay, perfect. Thank you. All right, hole number four. One that I see me get every single time in rookie. Um, and then in pro, haven't made it yet. So, interesting how you go from one uh, division to the next and you're like, huh, that's interesting. All right, Let's, it, this is the par three. Everyone knows it. Right there, pretty straightforward. We're gonna go um, backbone and uh, we're gonna add plus 25. I know, don't ask about these adjustments because these are my adjustments. We're gonna go plus 25. We're gonna go four backspin. We're gonna go one left spin. And we're going to put it to the right side of the stick. And we're going to hit perfect after max adjustment. Which, of course, I don't have on there. Uh, okay, I got it. Perfect. I got a message from someone who's also watching said, hey, you got to push it back up, dude. You can't just uh, <laughs> leave it way down over the cliff. So I got it. All right. Um, we have the plus 25. Where are we at? We are four back, one left. And are we up? Yes, we are. So. And indeed, we believe four back, one left. to see an overview of a candidate, but you're not hiring a resume. You're hiring a person. That's why Indeed offers tools that help bridge the gap between a candidate kind and of a right resume. there looks like skill tests which let you actually see a candidate's abilities in action to make sure they're a good fit for the job. See beyond the resume. 6.6 6. or is that is that Indeed Indeed for yourself or today and get a free sponsored job upgrade on your first posting at indeed.com/spotify. Terms and conditions apply. Let Audible heat up your summer fun. With an unmatched selection of audio entertainment, you can listen to anywhere, including exclusive Audible originals. Compelling stories, thrilling performances, and A-list celebrity talent make Audible originals ah. like Stan Lee's Alliances. Dang it. Light, performed by actress Yara Shahidi. Get it only from Audible or choose a title perfect for your... I didn't have it close enough on the green. I didn't have it far enough on the green um, with all that backspin. So I need to put that second bounce way closer on the green than I had it. Um, that's too bad. Mr. Bell, yes, sir. Welcome, sir. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for being here. Thank you, thank you. Yes, KD, just one pro because this is my exact last account that I have. Everything else is uh, absolutely gotten through. Expert, pro, five rookies, and uh, now this pro. Dang it, that's a miss right there, folks. That is a miss. Dang it, dang it, dang it. That's too bad. 
All right, well, I know uh, the adjustment was right in the hole. It's just I have to have that ball going up closer. I got to trust that uh, the ball guide up near the hole is going to stop with that four backspin and uh, get me in the hole and not go past. So Wally's in the house. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, KD, I hear you, brother. It's not easy being streamers and content providers, is it? Oh, boy. Good luck here. That's coming in hot, folks, hot. All right. We're going extra mile eight, sniper on the next shot so we can just get prepared for that um, at this point. I actually have to use a ruler on my piece of paper of notes so I don't get confused on which hole we're on and which notes to watch. That's how bad it is. All right, good luck, sir. Good luck. It's a tough shot, tough shot there. All right, let's see if we can't get our bag set up. Eight. Sniper. I think we want to go Kingmaker again, which is selected. That's fine. We're going to add 10%. Got the power three. I think everything else is good. Let's read through the notes. One top, full left. Max adjust. We got a pin chest. Let's open that real quickly here. Thank you again for all of you being here. I just want to reiterate that on a routine basis. I want to take a look at what my Amazon 4 does compared to the Nirvana. We got 129 and 59. That's 8. It's 8. 188. And we have 7. So we have 227. So we are going to put the Amazon on just in case we have any issues whatsoever with this crazy shot. Um, okay, here we go. I believe it goes from southeast to northwest on this wind. I think Murray Reed's in the house. Yes, sir. Forrest is in the house. Welcome, both of you. Thank you so much for being here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hater Todd is in the house. Yes, sir. Welcome, brother. Thank you for being in here. Thank you. No Spitfire. No, I didn't put the Spitfire on. Was I supposed to? There's no sand around here. I think I have a Spitfire, but I don't need a Spitfire on this hole, I hope, right? Because I'm either hoping just to get in the fairway and that'll be that. We won't have to worry about anything. Wow, 81 in New York. Wow, crazy. It was 90 here at uh, 6.30 when I was heading over to the gym. So, uh, yeah, we're all pretty... Uh, Strangled in this heat wave, for sure. One top, full left, right? Just got to tuck through this. Keep myself on pace here. Plus 10%. We got that. Power three ball in the in the grid. We're good. That's a really nice shot. If it does, it slows down, and it doesn't. All right. That was a fired up whatever ball that is. That was last tournament. All right. One top, full left.
probably don't even need much wind at all. Side wind's even better, right? So we need a little bit of overpower on this. So 3.1 is the rings. Perfect ball is what we wanted. We're looking for 370 some yards here. Oh, it's gotta go, go, go. Ah, it's short. 340, yuck. Hey, it's in the beautiful fairway. So uh, we have a shot at getting it up there close and making it two. And in some cases, maybe, just maybe, get it online and have it uh, have it knocked in. You know, these uh, sniper tens with all these ball guides and precision efficiency. Maybe we can get one uh, to roll in for us. <laughs> right, KD? <laughs> Cranking 75. Thank you, sir. How about we'll go up two? One and a half. How's that? One and a half. Right there. We'll just go one to one. Plus point three. Perfect ball. Ah, it's going to be short. Yep, a little short, but uh, and it was to the left. So I had that aimed a little bit too far to the left, it looks like. And um, maybe next time we can put a... Half a ball of side spin on that, maybe, and aim it right on the left edge of the cup. Still, see what happens there. But I need to be up farther than 340 in the first place. I need to be up in 360, 367 range to have the actual adjustment work, where you can go um, one backspin, one to one, plus point three, and you can knock it just to the left of the stick. And, uh, or aim it just left the stick and knock it in. Look at that. Bam. Okay. Well played. I don't know if it was well played. It was coming in hot as heck, but it went in. Boom. Good job. That just gives everybody else here about another three minutes of shootouts to watch. Congratulations. All right, I need to go back up and see a few things here. George is in the house. Welcome, sir. Sorry I missed you earlier, but I just moved up, saw you here. Thank you for being here, brother. So much appreciating that. Yeah, we're 83rd. I mean, we'll just, we're going to have to start. Um, yes, it is a great clan. It is. Oh, Murray, Baloney, you were really good to, um, to join. Were you kidding me? Stop it. We're, listen, our clan, Hell to the Gang, there's no clan points requirements. If you're a tournament player, that makes it even better. Um, we support one another. If you want to grind, we appreciate you grinding. But there are no grinding requirements each season, each day, each week. Nothing like that. So it's really laid back. And we just try to learn from one another and, you know, gain some perspective from one another. So that's pretty much... Uh, what we do, why we're here.
Well, that doesn't. You don't need to do that. Get up there. Two backspins too much. Only one is needed from there, I guess. All right, we take it anyway. All right. Good luck, Link. All right, there we go. Hole number five is completed with the eagle, which is important to get, obviously, as everybody knows. All important eagle. All right, hole number six, if we don't mind taking a moment, take a look at the schematic here. There it is. That's hole number five. Hole number six. Okay. Jesse Hundley's in the house. Yes, sir. Thank you for the good luck. <laughs> Hey man, I'll always take good luck. I would much rather, yes, minimum zero clan points a month. If you don't wanna play because of, you don't feel like it or because you have other requirements, uh, like me, I have a, a job that's extensive, um, or if uh, you're sick or you have a parent that's ill and you can't play, no one is ever gonna condemn you, no one's gonna call you, no one's gonna kick you, trust me. If you don't want to be there, you'll kick yourself, and that'll be that. So, welcome aboard. Now, if you haven't played for 70 days, you know, then we're going to have a concern, right? But uh, if you're playing on a regular basis, but you're not grinding, I'm perfectly fine with that. All right, 2-1-2-1-2. Two, one, two, one, two. Bam, now we need another two. We don't want to get another one here. All right, so this is going to be extra mile eight. Make sure we got it in the bag here. Extra mile eight, extra mile eight. We're gonna do plus 10 for cent. We're gonna do toe top spin. We're looking for 336 yards on a max adjustment on the tee shot. We're gonna get the Amazon out of there. We're not gonna put the razor on. Huh? We're gonna put the Nirvana back on. So that's recovered. We're gonna do Hornet on this shot because of it's more accuracy. And we're good. Let's go. <clears throat> nah, we got to put a katana on. Sorry, guys, gals, ladies, gentlemen. All right, let's do this. Hi, Jens. <laughs> Jens, I love you, man. You know that, right? Even though you never pick up my phone calls when I call you, I still love you, man. We're on strike two. You know that. This has been two times now, so <laughs> I'm just playing, man. You know I am. <laughs> I'm just not that kind of person, really. You always have good excuses, though. I never saw this wind before going like this. Did anybody, is this right? Is this wind right? <clears throat> we'll see. We're looking for 336 odd yards. Three hundred and thirty yards. That's gonna work out right really nice for us. It happened to me months, years. Okay, um, we're going to take off the elevation because we're going to use the wind arrow on this second shot. Contact them at 844 Ohio. See if we can't knock this in. Thanks, Jens. Appreciate that. Wayne, yes, sir. Welcome, my friend. That is awesome. Strength and endurance for the Los Angeles Lakers. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Essentials by Boss Bottle. I get to have conversations oh, that's a body that's an aggressive soul. opportunity right there with that navigator. Very nice. All right. You can listen to Maybe he'll get it up and right down there from the sand. Let's hope. Spotify. Wishing the best for him, right? 
All right, so let's go two back. The wind's going that way, so we have to go one left that way, right? But sometimes too many good options can be overwhelming. That's why Indeed doesn't just give you access to a large pool of job seekers. We also offer screener right there, tools that so. let you instantly narrow down your search. Hone in on hiring with Indeed. Experience Indeed for yourself today. 4.3 in job mid. Upgrade on your first posting at Indeed.com slash spot. Terms and conditions apply. Man, that's the second time I've done that. Man, did I not have that going to the left side of the cup? I thought I had that going to the left side of the cup because of the wind. And I had it one left spin, right? Yeah. Two bars back, one left spin into the left side of the cup. Or did I have it going into the right side of the cup? Ah! I think I had it going into the right side of the cup, and that's the reason why. Shucks. Papa Sloth, JPR, what's up? Thank you for the good luck, gentlemen. Thank you for being here. Outstanding. Thank you. Yeah, I made it uh, mid-adjustment, Forrest. It was, I played it mid, but uh, it was right on, right on pace. I just uh, need to get it on that left side of the, the hole. So it stays into the middle or right side of the cup as it comes up that hill with that wind push. So got to aim left, right inside of the cup. I had it right there. In what does that say? Aim left, but right inside the cup. Dang it. Ah. What another miss. Another missed opportunity. But that's okay. This is uh, qualifying, so now we know it. We got to make sure I even had it in bold. That's what's crazy. Wow. So these are qualifying. We'll, uh, we'll hone that in opening, and then we'll nail it. Um, in the weekend. So, uh, I want everyone to watch out for opening and weekend rounds for my accounts because, uh, we're going to be dialed in, ready to go. Just so you know, just saying that right out loud. Now I'm going to speak it into the world, right? That's what they say. Speak your truth. See what happens here. See if we can get this. So that's not what we wanted. And you know why we got that? Because I did not add the 25% adjustment. So that's exactly the reason why it went in that bunker. That right there. Again, luckily it's just a shootout. That was a mistake. You need to add that uh, elevation change on this one for pro. And that is the reason right there. It was in the sand trap. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Really nice position right now. Um, two, one, two, one, two, one. So let's go to hole number seven, which is the par three. Okay, I left that up too long last time. So we'll take it down now. All right, hole number seven. All right, what we're going to try here, which is crazy. I've never attempted this one before. This should be interesting. A rock seven, okay? And we're going to go quasar. That should be interesting. I've never, I've, I haven't used a quasar in two years. You're seeing it right here, right now on stream, a quasar. 
25% Dale. Yes, sir. Plus 25. Hissium. Yes, sir. Nice to see you, brother. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Jens. Look at my notes. All typed out, all precise, all easy to read, no chicken scratch, no scribbling, and I still miss it. Absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Oh, well. Okay, here we go. Quasar Rock. Goodness gracious, please let this work. You know how bad it was? I've n I haven't used a Quasar in so long. I even know what power it was. I thought it was power two. It's power one. How about that? Okay. <clears throat> Come on now. Here we go. I should probably just take the chicken way out and get the quarter, uh, the Sniper 10 out. Put it back in the middle of the fairway. Add 20 some percent on it. Do a little top spin. Aim it near the hole and make an easy birdie. But here, no. On the Screws Golf, what we're trying to do is make hole-in-ones. That's what we're trying to do here. Stupid. Especially on hard, hard holes like this. Crazy. <clears throat> Thank you, Archer. Thank you for being here, brother. Thank you for the good luck. <laughs> yeah, you do, Dale. You're a, you're a tour guy for sure, man. You love tour play. Love the tour play. Love me some tour play, says Apple B. What do we got here? Full back spin, minus one, full left. All right. Seven point nine off the rock. It is eight point nine holes. I need almost 1.9 now. Ah, don't be bad on that great ball. All right. Obviously, I did not need that side spin on that. That kept it really to the left. Also, that great ball helped it to the left. But if you take a look at that, where it ended up, that's just past pin high, not too shabby. I mean, that's a lot of work um, to try to make a hole in one on our first attempt there. And a lot of uh, wind adjustment, 8.9. You see how it rolled into that bunker and then uh, was a little bit difficult to get the final adjustment in. But we were able to accomplish the task of getting it on the green and hopefully su succeeding right now in a one putt birdie. One putt birdie. Okay, all right, I'm gonna show you guys my shirt here real quick after you see this putt go in the hole. All right, this is my uh, this is my real golf game in real life. Driver, eight iron, tap in. <laughs> ah, so that's what this game should be, right? Driver, eight iron, tap in every hole. Driver, eight iron, tap in on the par fours on this course. It's pretty funny. All right. Awesome. APOC 4. No, I know, Ricardo. I know, buddy. No curl. I did it and just was... I was scared. You know how it is. <laughs> nice, Dale. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <clears throat> 
Yeah, I'd come test your golf course there, Keith. Absolutely. Oh, yeah, Katie's a seven iron guy. Okay, very nice. Very nice. Okay, this is the last two holes for me are a test on the drive. So I'd really want to make sure that I concentrate and put all the right adjustments, concentrate and make sure that I hopefully won't have any issues here. So with that being said, we're going to start off with the ball power, which is a power three ball. Got that. We're going to go back to the bag and get a king maker. Put that in there. Okay, we're good there. Then what we're going to do is we're going to go to the APOC 3, which is fine. We got that. <clears throat> then full top, full right, and then I got to be careful of this, what he says, full curl, or what my a note says, full curl. I have to make sure that uh, I don't do full, full curl, because that APOC is just out of control when it goes to the right. So, so I need the red ring cutting the rough, but we're going to now change that to the blue ring. Blue ring cutting the right rough. And then we got Hornet, got that. And we're gonna go plus 30% on that. So put the plus 20 in, we have the power three. We absolutely need to change that to an APOC three. We'll leave that in, need to change. Uh, we'll leave the backbone in. We have the Hornet, what we want, okay. All right, we look good here. All right, let's see if this works. <clears throat> All right, that's set up right with that uh, white ring. That's what we're following, or the white, white line. <clears throat> let's get it done. Come on. All right, we got it away perfect. <clears throat> Let's see if this works. Oh, man. <clears throat> we'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take it. Give me about uh, four something, right? 405. That's what we want. Bam. Okay. All right. Sometimes, I'm gonna be honest with everybody here, um, sometimes I get a little excited in the game and I use both the downhill adjustment as well as the, um, <laughs> as the wind arrows. And that puts a completely different number in there and then sometimes, you know, that causes havoc by putting you in the rough or, you miss the tee, sh the tee shot or even the second shot. So I got to make sure I stay out of the habit of um, utilizing that wind app and the arrow app at the same time. So here we go. What is this? Three and one left. Six point one is almost behind us. We're going to go mid. Mid adjustment. Five point eight.
Gotta be kidding me. Wow. Oh, that's right, Dale. Thank you for being on my side on that one, buddy. <laughs> Thank you, Wayne. That's a, uh, I see that occasionally on the, um, on the streams. Like, there you go. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer had a very shiny nose. Gosh darn it, I can't believe we missed that. All right, we're going to have to tweak that adjustment now as well. So, we had uh, three back, one left, and we still missed it to the right. So, now we're going to have to aim ball guide. left of pin. All right, that'll take care of it next time for sure. All right. But a well-played hole, if I say so myself. All right, a well-played hole for sure. What do we got here? Craig Moody's in the house. Yes, sir. Welcome to see you, my friend. Thank you for being here. Thank you, Jason, for that. You're right. Opening round. Can't wait for that, everybody. Uh, summertime is finally here. And <laughs> Emily, I love it. <laughs> yeah, almost, Keith. Very close. Very close. All right. Well, we made the birdie, which is what we needed to do. I think that's actually going to take care of business for us in this grouping. Um, yeah. Yeah. We should be uh, we should be pretty good shape if we don't uh, mess this one up. Okay. So let's go to the bag here. Um, we're going to want to use a Kingmaker again, so we're going to leave that alone. Power 3 is all good over there. We're going to do um, just a 1-to-1 one -one adjustment on this. Actually, we don't need to do any adjustment or any anything. We're just going to hit it. So we're going to go quarterback 10. Three top, full left. Then we need the Goliath in the bag, so we want that, because we're gonna go on the left side and hit it off that little pad if we're fortunate enough to hit an accurate tee shot here. We have the Kingmaker in. All right, we have Sniper, uh, Quarterback, Goliath, Hornet, Firefly, Nirvana. We're ready to go. All right, so what we're going to do here is we're going to go to the left side and we're going to do kind of like a power slice, right? Not even a power slice, just a slice, right? Where we're What we're going to do is we're going to go down there. We're going to find our spot. We're going to go three top spin. We're going to go um, full left spin. And then we're going to do um, a pretty nice curl, full curl with the uh, quarterback 10. And then uh, make sure we adjust for the wind based off of... Um, the direction is coming. So 6.4 is really a one-to-one. -one, so we just really don't need to, like I said, really worry about the arrow or the, um, the downhill adjustments. We'll just move it across this, the, um, the fairway and try to give ourselves a landing spot that's going to be precise. Look at that. Boy, that's nice. Nice shot. Nice shot. Nice shot. I would uh, right now change places with him and take that shot if they wanted to give it to me. <laughs> Three top, full left. And it's only four miles an hour, so probably right about there.
All right, absolutely perfect position, my friends. Thank you, sir. 346 yards straight down line of that um, pad. And uh, so now that we've done that and we've accomplished that, we're gonna go ahead and um, take off the elevation. That, well, we didn't have anything on there in the first place, so that's good. We're gonna go Goliath eight, and we're gonna do one and a half backspin, and we're gonna do full right spin. We're gonna do a probably most likely a mid adjustment. We're gonna have that ball guide tracking directly into the hole. See if we can't hit it perfect and somehow get it close. And if we cross our fingers hard enough, put it in for the do, the deuce, the albatross. All right, so right, look at that. Max is there. Min, so we're gonna be right about min. Okay, so one and a half, full, And then, so 2.8. Perfect ball. Let's see what happens. All right, not bad. Need to have that come down actually off of the, um, off that slope. Do you see how high it was up on that slope with my adjustment? I need to start my adjustment lower, if that makes sense, so that when it comes in there, it's not gonna hit that high bank and uh, stay up there. So not an overall bad shot there um, at all. I'm pretty pleased with that outcome. Make a little putt here, get an eagle, go 13 under in pro. Pretty respectable. We had two shots on holes number, well, three actually. Four was going right in, but we left it a little short because I didn't aim far, or I didn't put the ball guide far enough. Six, we missed um, because I aimed at the right side of the cup instead of the left side of the cup. And then hole number eight, again, we aimed at the uh, the middle of the cup instead of to the left side of the cup and just missed by half a nudge. So uh, those are three more shots that we might be able to drop over the opening and weekend rounds. And if we do, we've accomplished 13 under. We get those three drops. That's 16 under potentially. So really confident going into this, uh, this Thursday, Friday opening round with these pro accounts. So uh, absolutely stoked with uh with some of the adjustments that we have going on right now so thank you ashley oh you're the best honey thank you thank you thank you golf clash it's your connection nice sir thank you for being here thank you uh for the compliment there sir thank you jason for the uh the reminder for the stream of hitting thumbs up much appreciated if you are not a member of on the screws golf you like this content you like what you saw tonight you know we have eight accounts and we have a lot of banners and we have a lot of top places finishes so uh if you want to come and have some fun meet some really great people hit the subscribe button if you don't mind and uh come on back when we uh, and hit the notification bell, so when you uh, when you get notified, you can come on in and join the party. Cause it's a party here most of the time. Sometimes it's not when I miss and I get discouraged and people have to talk me off the ledge. Oh, great ball left. So maybe a great ball hole in one. Uh, no. Way too hard. That's going to go down to 11, maybe? 11.7? 11.3. And I think he was short of about 9, so we're going to lose this one? Yep. All right. Good game, Adam. Good luck, sir. Good game. Well played. Good job. Get out of here. 
and let's take a look at it minus 13 so there it is we got the drop on one which was the only drop of the night but like i said we had four six and eight just within centimeters and we'll get those uh connect connected uh for the opening and the weekend and i just want to say it out loud right now watch out for um hashtag 19 pa bells the hank account in pro because it's going to get on the railroad tracks and it's going to go like a runaway engine man we are looking for gold on this account um with those close misses and that good score yeah we're ready to we're ready to put some numbers up tonight uh this weekend so again i want to say thank you to everybody for being here um amazing support from everyone we had over 40 people at one point in here tonight thank you so much um much appreciated if anybody has any questions whatsoever you always can reach out on facebook to me um i know there's a, a lot of new streamers that are trying to get into it um or at least content creators if you need help with obs or any type of settings or clip art or anything like that you can always reach out via um facebook be more than happy to help you and um i look forward to seeing everybody tomorrow at some point because i'm going to do a bunch of rookies tomorrow and then uh, we're going to save the magic pros and expert for friday night so with that being said i love all of you i look forward to seeing you again tomorrow have a wonderful evening god bless you all and see you soon let's go